Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to import any of the Mizamo 3D avatar and its animations into Unreal Engine 5.0.1 to make it become a skeleton mesh and its animation sequence. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. First you can scroll down, go to my video descriptions to enter the Mizamo, click into the first link to enter the Mizamo. Next, in your Mizamo, I'm going to, to demo to show you how to choose an avatar. Go to the character here. Here you can see there are three pages. There are about 100 avatars, three avatars at here. Right. As demo, I'm going to choose one of it. For example, I choose this. Maria, Maria Zhe Ong. The first step, what you are going to do is click download. It will download as FBX in Peoples. Click download. And now you can see it downloaded as FBX file. It is going to, to save into the download folder. You can right click your file explorer. Go into the download folder. Here, this is the download folder Maria ZZ on or you can just click here show in folder the FBX is here Next, I'm going to show you how to find and find the animation So you have to select the avatar ready to make sure the character ready here then go to the animation Right in the animation here, for example, I search the MMA kick, press enter. Now I can see an MMA kick. If I click on that, this is the animation. So if I want this, I can just click download. Here, choose without skin, 30 frames per second, click download. It will download the FBX file with animations into your download folder as well. Now you can see it is in my download folder. Right click refresh. The MMA kick FBX is already here. And maybe I want to search another one that is a walk. We just try two, two of it. You can see now we need to click in place so that in your game engine of the Unreal Engine 5.0.1, it will maintain at the same position. So here you can click download without skin, 30 frames per second, click download. Wait for a while. And then now in this folder, right click refresh, you can see actually we already have the FBX 3D avatar together with two of the FBX file animations. These two only contain the animation. So now I can close the Mizamo. And next I'm going to the Epic Game Launcher. I will launch my Unreal Engine 5.0.1. So I will launch it. And start from now I'm going to show you how am I going to create a fresh new project and import, import the Mizamo avatar into that. So here I'm going to choose to create a new game, a third person game. The project name will be my project to Mizamo to Unreal to UE5. Right now I click create. It is going to create a, a fresh new game so that I can show you how am I going to import it. Right, now you can see a new project is finished loaded. If you try to play, this is the new project in Unreal Engine 5.0.1. This is a third person new project. Right, press escape. So now how am I going to import the Mizamo, the, the FBX file into here? 
Right, this is the download folder just now. So in your Unreal Engine 5.0.1, by default, you can't see the content browser. You have to click the window, show the content browser so that you can see here. Next, under your content, click the content, right click, right click new folder. Then here I'm going to name this as Mizamo Avatar. I double click in this folder, right click create another new folder, name this avatar as Maria. Right, because just now I, I saw this avatar name is Maria ZZ Ong. So now I double click in the Maria's folder and drag in the Maria ZZ Ong FBX. Drag in. And here I click import all. <coughs> it is going to to import the whole FBX. This is just a message log. You can close it. Right. Now you can see which one is Maria ZZ on skeleton mesh. This pink color here. Double click. You can see this is the skeleton mesh. So next you are going to import the animation. Right click, new folder, animation. Double click in. And then you can see two of the animation there, the walking and MMA kick. So click the first one, hold the control and click the second one. I drag in into animations folder. So now the skeleton, you must choose the Mario ZZO. And then the, the animation length, you must choose the animated kind. This is very really important. Next, click import all. Now you can see under the Marias folder, the skeleton mesh is already there. Press, press E, you can rotate. I already drag it out. And then now I'm going to drag the animations as well. The first one is the MMA kick. The next one is walking. You can put it here. Now, now I try to play. Now you can see. This is the skeleton mesh with T pose, and here you have another one. The walking, and then the MMA kick is at here. All the skeleton mesh and animation sequence are already here. Right. Now we already successfully imported the Mizamo 3D avatar and its animation to make it become a skeleton mesh and animation sequence in Unreal Engine 5.0.1 And that's all for today, thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all, so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy animation and game developing! See you!